In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Amen. Jesus, Mary, and St. Joseph, St. Teresa, pray for us. Why are so many people moving to Post Falls, Idaho? Could it be, in fact, that they have bad sacramental marriages and these women in SUVs are just doing whatever, whatever, with their heads cut off, moving their husbands from here to there in their big SUVs? I mean, you got to wonder because a lot of these families now are led by the women. And it's not very healthy for the marriage. But also, you got to think about the generational curses as well. I know in my family, my mother, she was always talking smack about my dad behind his back. And it really, you know, wears on the woman to hear that language. And then, you know, obviously divorcing him and stuff, taking control through the courts. It really doesn't help because that's a huge generational curse that draws down onto all the children to the fourth degree and if you times that by everybody because I think most people now my age have divorced parents whether you're Catholic or not and all those bad energy going through and the women basically do not want to be subservient to the husbands and that's a huge huge problem I know my mother still suffers from that to this very day and if she can only just accept my dad as he is and actually like become turn herself back to a woman it helps so much and get rid of her love affair. Go back to my dad, which is actually, you know, she's going to have to go against the clergy to uphold the sacraments because they're more willing to have my mom jump into bed with her her friend's husband than to go back to my dad. And that's sick. 